Hey guys, my name is Sidiac and welcome back to another episode of City Bus Manager where we are continuing to build the best electric bus company uh, San Francisco has ever seen right now. And last episode, boys, we completely rejigged, redone my whole bus depot. My whole buildings were mainly over here in the center, or kind of, well, not in the center, but on the edge over there. And we've completely moved them into an area of this big rectangle, which will, it will eventually expand and fill. Uh, just so it's more centralized to my actual depot, so when a driver, mechanic, cleaner, whoever they may be, needs to go and get a bus or go to a bus, we're in a more centralized location to all the parking spaces that will eventually be around it. Now, it does mean that my service center remains over here, uh, which then gives us technically the ability to make it a little bit bigger to handle the backlog for when times do get busy. But I spent so much money last episode. So much money i don't know where you can kind of see it right now but look at the the funds the previous day i spent over three hundred thousand. absolutely ridiculous but today we are hopefully going to get back into it boys back into the routine of doing what we should be doing from day one and that's trying to run a goddamn bus company uh, guys, if you are enjoying this series so far, then make sure you smash that like button down below. Subscribe if you are new right here so you get notified when more episodes do come out. But boys, the bus company is... It's expanding, baby. It is slowly expanding. Now, some of you boys uh, in last episode uh, gave me some really good suggestions about uh, the fact that I should also build maybe a canteen or a restroom for the service center. Because right now, if they need to do anything, they've got to walk out this door, walk all the way around like this person's doing right now, and then walk all the way back it's a little bit of a long-winded process for them, but I don't mind it being long for them. It's the other fools that I kind of mind. So what we need to do then, we need to kind of get back into the routine of making some sweet, sweet cash. We kind of need to build some more routes. We need to buy some buses. And the actual depot itself will just be a slow, slow progress of me just continually updating it. That's all I can do, boys. That is literally all I can do at the moment. Now, one of the biggest things that I want to get done is the shift scheduler. That is going to play a huge role in your boy being able right now to kind of automate the company as much as possible. Now, to be able to do it, if I go to the research and it's all the way at the bottom, it's 20,000 big ones and 175 trophies. We have uh, 223. So we've got enough trophies. We just need 20,000 big ones in the bank and we can kind of get that uh, uh, research and underway. Uh, so that will be my first focus to what we get done. So my current goals right now is to sell 17,000 tickets. So I got more assignments coming in, boys. Um, sweet, 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 sweet. Get 1,316 active weekly ticket holders, which again, will eventually get done as well. Now, is there anything else I can research in the meantime? Is there anything else that will kind of create automation? Ah, yes. So eventually it will be nice to get automated bus washing. Uh, I need 240 trophies for that. That means just like the cleaning on the inside, they'll take it to the bus wash to automatically get done. Then I no longer have to do anything apart from repairing the buses when they do break. Right, that's huge. That is actually huge. Right, we're about to break 20,000 big ones, which we've now just done. Um, let's get the shift scheduler now researched. So that will take a huge part of the kind of uh, the process away from what I need to do, like the small little bit of micromanagement. It means that I can kind of preempt and kind of schedule the buses on whatever routes with whatever drivers, which are going to make a huge, huge difference uh, for the bus company ourselves. Uh, so I'm actually quite excited about that. I really am. Now, other stuff we need to do is get more bus chargers in the parking spots that don't have them. And these solar panel things need to go over the top as well. Now, in terms of electricity, we've actually made 61 big ones today already. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it, boys. But we've still got a long way to go. I can't express how long we've still got to go. So, what would I do in terms of a new route? If I go to my routes and go to new route, I do have the option to set up another public service line. Uh, because look at how much money you get a week for them. But in doing so, in doing so, you, I'm going to need at least three or four buses for it. So I feel like I need to buy a few more buses. Oh, we got a broken bus. We got a broken bus before I can do it. So it needs a new indicator. We'll get you scheduled to be repaired. 
which is pretty sweet pretty sweet now somebody said somewhere that there is a way in which i can kind of in the settings isn't it yeah uh, automatically clean inside the bus when it's below 90 percent yeah that sounds pretty good i think i'll keep that setting as it is or do i make or do i kind of increase it a little bit more maybe 95 percent then we clean buses i would like to be known as having the cleanest buses in all the lands that's what i would like to be known as it might mean that I need more cleaners in general, but we do have four of them. So they'll get through it. They'll get through it, boys. I just can't wait to have the automatic cleaning or the bus washing of it as well. That will be a huge help. Right, they're almost done with the shift scheduling anyway, getting that all researched. While we do wait, there's a few little areas that I need to kind of add uh, so I can get some plants in. So we kind of did it over here. We got a uh, two gap there, a three, and a one. So it's a two gap... Okay, I, I can only do it in stages, right? Delete you. Because this is where we're trying to get all the plants in for the environmental bonus. Delete you. Oh! Something else as well, someone told me. I need to change my energy supplier. That's another way in which I can get a huge bonus as well. So uh, let me just get these outdoor plants in. Oh, we've got the shift scheduler now all set up, which is perfect. Get those in. There we go. I think there's a gap over here I kind of slightly missed as well. I can actually go around the whole edge in. Of that. And obviously... I'm not actually sure where it kind of... It should end. I think it will end the same here. So again, I'm just kind of preempting where stuff is going to run to. So that should be two more bus washes in that little area. So I'm just kind of pre-planning it all out. If it all works anyway. That's if it all works. So the shift scheduler then. Where is it? Here it is. So this allows me then to automatically assign all buses and all drivers to all the routes. I don't know though, if I go settings, uh, maximum duration of a shift, uh, desired period between bus drivers, two shifts. Oh, okay, that's pretty good. Uh, what's this here, buses? At least 0 0.5 hours for buses. Oh, period between buses. I'll do an hour. Because it will give us the availability to kind of clean, repair, or anything like that. I'll give it two hours between bus driver shifts, so it gives them time to go to the restroom, get some food, sit down, relax. And... Yeah. We'll keep it, give them a maximum of eight hours working time. I think I'm being very, very kind there, aren't I? I think I'm being very, very kind. Now... Is there a way in which I can make it where certain buses do certain routes? Does that, does that make sense? I'm not sure if, if that's a thing I can do. Fleet number, um, is it on the routes themselves? Route statistics? If I edit, for example, route one, uh, is there a way in which I can kind of change the settings? I don't think so. Discard all changes. Route one. Uh, let's edit the route. Assign depot, route name, edit show timetable. Whoa, that's crazy. Uh, edit timetable, advanced settings. Is there a way in which I can say like it only has double deckers on it? Is 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 there a way for me to do? Oh, preferred vehicle group. Ah, right. Okay, okay. Right, okay, okay. Now I've now I've realised where it is. Um, right, how do I get out? Confirm. Right, um... Bus route was created successfully. Activate bus route now. Wait, what? Have I just created a new route? No, I haven't. I got confused then for a second. Right, route three. If I edit the timetable advance, and it should only have a preferred group of double deckies. There we go. I, I'm, I think you can also create your own route, um, kind of, things as well, can't you? So, double decker buses, confirm... Right, that should be all done. So this here now is a vehicle group double-decker. We do have the little solos, which I believe this route over here, which is route two. I can edit this timetable, advanced settings, and say that you're only going to be solo buses. Confirm you. So I've done it for route three. Yeah. I've done route three, which is this one going down here. Route 2, right, Route 5, 
which is this one here, I'm going to also make that double deckers because the amount. Oh no, that makes loads of money because it's a public service line, doesn't it? See, now I'm a little bit confused with what buses need to go on where. But I reckon we made the other ones just freehand and we'll kind of see what happens. So if I go to the shift scheduler then, if I also pick tomorrow and I assign automatically the buses, right? Not all shifts could be assigned because your company does not have enough buses. So that's where normally you'll have a few buses that kind of overlap. You can see the current routes that don't have enough buses for. I'm going to automatically assign the drivers. Not all shifts could be assigned because we don't have enough bus drivers. Now, you could also argue because of the time schedule we put between the buses, that's where we're now slowly falling short with not having enough buses. But at least we have a rough idea that we don't have enough. We can add more to it. But I'm loving the idea that I can now schedule all the double-deckers to a certain route to make maximum money. That's quite exciting. That really is. So with that knowledge, am I able to quickly buy a second-hand bus? Hmm. Right, it's going to be difficult because I don't have the funds to maybe buy a cheap one. The city ones, can I send an offer for you? Rejected, that's fine. Uh, and that's it, that's all I'm getting. I'm going to have to time jump. So technically, I don't have enough buses for the next day. But also, I don't have to assign anything either. Now, the bus routes that we're missing are a little bit earlier in the day. But they do... Oh, it's route 2. It all needs solo buses. Right, okay. So, bus fleet. Use buses. Can we get some cheap solos? Oh, they accepted my offer. Okay, that's perfect. Another city one. Send offer. Oh, no, I don't have enough. I, I can only buy one. What am I talking about? I can only buy one. So repair it. It needs new brake pads and a tire. Right. So we'll get that done real quickly. Now, even though we have technically four four jobs. What would you call it? Four shifts that we can't schedule. That one bus should be able to do at least two. It should be able to do at least two. So just wait for it to kind of now get repaired. This is kind of cool seeing my new depot now working. <laughs> it is really good, isn't it? I do need more bus drivers, though. So maybe while we are waiting, we're going to hire some new employees. Bus drivers, certified by skill. Uh, one, two, three. We've hired three more. We'll see how we get on with those. So we're going to paint you. Now, I wonder if I can now schedule the buses. So... I've scheduled the buses, but we still don't have enough. I can schedule the drivers. So we have enough drivers. We just don't have enough buses still. So local templates, eFolio, apply. Dan, dan, dan. We are done. We are done. Now, is it possible to kind of make a parking space? It's not possible to make a parking space like double-decker only, right? That's not the case, is it? Because I can't select it to make it do anything. I'm just wondering if that was like a possibility where you can assign a parking space for like a double decker. If that's a thing, boys, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, right. See, this is good because I haven't got to assign anything. But obviously, we're just not making enough money right now to get more buses. So, double decks are doing their thing. Uh, it's just this route here can't have assigned any double deckers to it, so it, it kind of is reliant on solo buses. But this route here is solely right now double deckers. And even then, they're pretty much filling them up. <laughs> they really are, aren't they? I reckon this route here could probably do with double decker because it seems to be a busy bus there. It would be nice eventually to have them all set to it. See, this is now my issue. I now need to assign buses to the line. But I'm going to assign that bus there because it was technically available. But that's all I can do. There's nothing else I can wait for right now or do. And it might miss its next schedule. Oh, no, boys. Oh, no. This is why I need to get more buses. Before, you could just kind of do it. But the way that I've now set it all up means I've kind of slightly messed myself up, haven't I? I kind of have. Right. Can I lowball this one? Rejected. 
Um, I don't want to buy an E-Way. I don't want to go down the road of having to buy an E-Way just for the sake of it. <laughs> I mean, I could sell it. <laughs> buy a new bus, a city, it's 24,000 big ones. I could buy a new one, but I, again, I'm so stuck in my ways of buying secondhand. You know what I mean? But I could buy a new bus. For the sake of assigning a shift. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right, there we go. Load. Local templates. It got delayed, but it doesn't matter. It still got assigned. <laughs> it's still technically got... I don't like doing that. I don't like paying full price. I don't know whether it's because I'm just so stubborn. <laughs> right? But I don't like paying full price for a bus. Anyway. That's given us a new buses. So automatically assigned buses. It still hasn't completed these routes. Because we still don't have enough buses. Not with how it's got set up anyway. So if I do tomorrow, automatically assign... If I reset, you're still missing a few options. We have enough drivers, just not enough solo buses, and it's mainly for Route 2. I could change the settings and then have the ability to to kind of get the, the buses for the routes. Because I could just very, very easily change the settings and... Uh, you know, wait you know, half an hour, which if I do it tomorrow, okay, that doesn't really change anything for tomorrow. What about today? Doesn't change anything for today. Reset, then do it. No, that, that extra time doesn't really do much, and I'd rather have that time to like fix or clean a bus, so we're all, always staying on top of our game. But the way the money's coming in, right, the way the way the money's coming in right now, it's not long before I can buy another brand new one. But I'll try and get a second-hand one. Uh, we'll lowball an, uh, an E-Way. They rejected it. Uh, Electroliner. I mean, lowballing Electroliner, you need it 29,000 minimum. Rejected. Fine. Oh, there we go. City bus. I mean, do I go to about 15,000? In the hopes that they'll accept that. They accepted that. That's that's that, that, now me not, you know, being foolish. Oh, no. No. Uh, Repairing-wise, it doesn't really need any repairs. It will eventually come back and need new tyres. Um, it's being cleaned. I'll quickly paint it, but while that happens... Tomorrow, reset, assign... Hold on. Load. Templates. E-Folio. Am I getting confused with this right now? Hold on. Tomorrow. Assign drivers. Drag and drop shifts. Why is it I can't... Assign... And why does that bus not have the ability to be assigned? Oh, I've just realized why. I'm such an idiot. I've just realized why. These are classed as minibuses. I did not realize those were classed as minibuses. Oh, the penny's just dropped, boys. I'm so sorry. The penny has just dropped. I didn't realize they were classed as minibuses. So I do have enough buses. So today, there you go. Tomorrow, if I now reset it. Oh, the pennies just dropped, guys. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm going to create a public service line now. <laughs> to see. See if I can you know, have enough buses for that. I should really extend this, though. This is This is an issue. But I'm too excited now. I'm too excited. So I want to go down the road then of building a new route, okay? New route. And we'll do this one here. 504 tours. We'll go all out. We'll go all out. Uh, and he's connected to 3,122 buildings. 618 points of interest. 
at least 10 stops runs Monday to Friday, Saturday and Sunday, and at least 250 meters between each distance of each stop. We will accept. So obviously it's got to be connected and around San Francisco. We have a fair few buses here that we can make it do the loop around. But I feel like we should make it go in a different direction. Maybe we bring it down this area. I don't know how we would bring it down this area. We'll kind of see. But where's that loop anyway? The loop is... Duh, 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 duh. I believe the loop is just here. So I can bring it up, turn it down. And maybe this is the kind of the loop, the new loop. Unless I bring it up this way. Well, if I went there to there, or maybe not, to there, to there. Okay, let me change this to like a color I can see and stand out. So then down to here. Right. And then where would I take it next? I could bring it down this road. And then down here, which is not too bad. It just depends if it all goes to play. It all goes to place. Or all goes to plan. Right, if I go here then. Works. And then there. No. So they don't like the idea of making that turn. But what if I make the turn? No. Actually, a better idea. If I then make it stop there, can I make it go down here and then down here? Ha ha! So I've made it connect to multiple lines, multiple routes within the loop that we have them all connected to here, which is kind of cool. So bringing this now down, and we should quite dramatically, very quickly, complete... Well, let me show the coverage. Um, this route right now. Right, down to there. So it's the points of interest we're kind of also looking at. All the way down. And then we've got to think about then... Oh, we could, could we use this as the roundabout to connect back round? So if I went... Yes, yeah, so if I went here... Or not. And then... Bam. No. We'll go here. Right, we have to use a waypoint. So using this as the roundabout to kind of turn and go back around. That's kind of hilarious, isn't it? So then heading back up. And providing this is all now going to work out. And that we shouldn't have any issues. Which I can't see as having any. And... Did that work? So there. Now this is where the fun and games now begins. I've got to somehow... Which, bring it to here, don't I? So what if I go there... No, that doesn't really work out. Uh, I mean, it does the job. It's a bit funky, but it will do the job. Oh, my points of interest have not been met. Yikes. Right, okay. Right, this is the downside of this. I kind of... You, you do forget... Oh, why am I deleting it? I just realized I can add on to it. Right, I can add on wherever I want to add it on. There's nothing stopping me. So if I go there and then do... There... To there? Because I can pick spots. Like, I know down here now, for example... We have the Mission Street and Highland Avenue... So, Mission Street. 
there's the waypoint mission street and harlan avenues let's say for example i deleted this one and then just there i then insert a stop let's say i went down to here and then i went to here there 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 I'm trying to figure out about going round a little bit more than what I'm doing because I've got to try and give us a little bit more coverage than that I'll tidy it all up in a minute and then we go to this one here. If I, so if I delete this... If I, no, actually, if I delete the waypoint... And then I delete... I don't, I'm not sure which one I'm deleting here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Right, I, I'm a little bit all over the place now, aren't I? I'm a little bit all over the place right now. So... This is the one I want to delete. So Tomkins, which is this one. So it almost gives us the coverage we require. But we're listening a little bit much out right now. So we get back up to Van Ness here, Market. The Mission 13, which is that one. I'm going to get rid of you. And here, can I make it go this way? No, because that one's there. Delete you. So we're making what we call our little dog bones a little bit more dog bony. <laughs> you know what I mean? There you go. Confirm that. Right. I'll explain what I've just done in just a second. Um, easy mode. I need... Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I need six buses. But you got to think the amount of money I'm going to make on this route. So I'm going to confirm it. Oh, I'm probably going to cry doing this. I'm probably going to cry. Uh, confirm. Um, activate bus route now. Right, pause a second. So, what I've had to do, and I'm probably going to go in and edit it again. But basically, right, I treat this as the top end of the dog dog bone. That's the kind of the big radius going around. Ignore that it goes a bit weird. Right, ign ignore that it goes a little bit weird. And then down here, there's the other end of the dog bone as it kind of comes around to link back up. So, it's a bit funky because of how it has to link to that stop, unfortunately. Um, I could maybe try and edit the route. So when it gets to there, so this one here, you could add in a bit of a waypoint, but it's still got to go through it. I mean, this is this is only to make it visually look like okay. Hang on, I'm putting this in the wrong place. What if I put the waypoint here? Does it, does it look a little bit better? Maybe it's not as noticeable. Maybe it's not. But this will now truly tell us how many buses we're now actually missing. So my shift schedule... It's only one. Now this is for today. Let me reset it for tomorrow. So there's a lot more for tomorrow. But that's only because we've done all the routes for today. So, between now and tomorrow... Oh, we need more drivers as well. Uh, we are going to need to get a few more drivers. Hire employees, bus drivers. Right. Assign drivers. Yep. But I can't sign enough buses. So back into play mode then, right? 
We're going to... We should be able to buy a second-hand bus now as well. So buy a used bus. Let me see what I can get cheap again. So any cheap Electroliners? Someone will accept for me. Anybody? Anybody want to take a cheap offer? I could buy these so reasonably, but I want to get a good price. And in doing so means I'm being rejected left, right, and center. To the point where there's no more electric buses for them to offer to me. <laughs> so I'm down fast uh, to buy a new bus. Uh, Electronize 52,000. We'll buy another city one. All right. That's fine. Oh, I can't believe I'm buying brand new buses. It goes against everything that I ever said. Uh, sign buses, sign drivers, fine. Tomorrow, if I now reset it, automatically sign buses, automatically sign drivers. Still too few bus drivers. Still too few bus drivers. But it just shows you how many more buses we need. But until now, until tomorrow, we should be able to earn a few pennies to buy a few more buses. Right, this is taking it to the next level now, boys. I can't express how much I'm now taking my company. I am stress testing the company. <laughs> I really am. So, it is a Monday. We have made decent amount of revenue. It might rival three days ago, which would have been the Friday. Obviously, Saturday, Sunday don't count because they're weekends. Do we have a bus on this route yet? No, but it is getting a little bit busy in this little circle over here right now where they all kind of uh, crissy-crossy one another. Which is uh, pretty cool to see. So, bus fleet, use buses. I'll try and be reasonable where I can, but I feel like I need that to re refresh. Yeah. That service centre is on its last legs as well. Now we've got another bigger route set up, which is going to have even more people on it. Uh, it's going to bring more people to the actual service centre. It's all stress, isn't it? It's all stress that your boy does not need. Have they refreshed the bus list yet for the used? No. No. But we've got a plan anyway. We've got a plan. We can kind of see that this is a very, very busy bus route as well, by the looks of it. Or is it just that? Was it that just the initial first bus? Because this is all based on um, commissions as well. So many. So many commissions we're going to make from it. <laughs> so many. Which is going to pay for a lot of stuff. Use buses. Still nothing new yet. Still nothing new. Right, the day's coming to an end anyway. Worst case scenario, I'll buy a used bus. Uh, sorry, a brand new bus. I could even maybe buy a brand new double decker, depending on how much money I get coming in. But the day's not over yet, boys. The day's not over. A lot of buses need to be cleaned. Uh, what did I need again to be able to... Oh, 240. I need 240 trophies to be able to automatically clean a bus. Which basically means sell the 17,000 tickets. We'll get 17 trophies, which will give me exactly 240. Right, we'll hold... Oh, there's a bus there. Not looking very good. Indicator. There we go. There we go. There we go. Right, we are playing the waiting game still. So I could buy a brand new Electroliner. But I could also lowball 36,000. They accepted my offer for that Electroliner. So any repairs needed? No. Just got to paint it. Just got to paint it. So that leaves me a little bit more money left over to where I could maybe then utilize that tomorrow. So if I reset... Automatically schedule, automatically assign. Need more drivers. That's fine. That is fine. But at least we've put a little bit of a dent into tomorrow's. None of them are early starts, not until midday. So it gives me a bit of time in the morning to make additional cash. Are we still making money? We are. Uh, make additional cash to lowball another offer. Right, use buses. Any cities? 
Um, our low ball, 14,000. Accepted that. That's another big help for us. It's okay at the minute. Just needs painting. And then as of tomorrow, we've took another one or two off. I'll, I'll reset that again in just a minute because it helps. Uh, local templates, e folio. I still need to get some more drivers. So let me reset tomorrow's. It's still free required. Alright, hire employees, bus drivers. I just hired five more bus drivers. So that there gives me enough bus drivers in general. Yeah, that gives me enough bus drivers in, in general. Let's time hop. There we go. Oh, can I time jump again? Yeah, a couple, couple more minutes. <laughs> okay. Okay. There's a bus there broken down. Can I, it needs a new indicator. It's difficult to see right now with these solar panels over the top. It's, it's easy to miss that a bus is smoking. It can be quite easy to miss. Right, buses are now going out. And they'll be making us some sweet, sweet money. Now we got a dog bone over here. We can maybe link up a route to that. Same down here as well. Wait, am I paying for a bus stop over here? Yeah, get rid of you. Don't know why I'm paying for you. And... Right, so bus fleet. Use buses. Right, lowball some more cities. I have to completely lowball that. But you're more likely to get a good price if you raise it slightly. So what do you reckon I should do? Wait for a few more pennies and kind of put in a little bit of a higher offer. Oh, I can put that. I can put our offer in now. Right, let's go. Five thousand eight hundred. Once I've got five thousand eight, there we go. Oh, they rejected it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> they rejected it anyway, boys. Alright, 16,000. Rejected. No more. No more. Right, we can earn a bit more money anyway. we got a bit more freedom still. we still got a bit more freedom. But the only reason it's taking so long right now to get these ticket ones done, these ticket missions, because I've just set up another public service route. Which is not ticket-based, it's commission-based. I made, yesterday was the most money I've ever made in a single day. How much is it? It was profit. Whoo, damn. And I spent it all on buses. I spent it all on buses. Oh my goodness me. I, I can't wait until we eventually flip the switch. Just to buy, making every bus a big bus. But I'll have to wait until... We've researched every single electric bus in the game, so I know which is the biggest bus I can use. Is, will it be an articulated? Will it be a double decker? I don't know. And then we just f uh, flip the switch where we completely s sell all our buses and only buy the biggest bus. So we just have maximum capacity on every route. What do you want? No. <laughs> I'm so mean. Right, I gotta start taking it serious now because. Before you know it, we are going to start seeing the new assignments coming in. Oh, they accepted that. Oh, perfect. But what's wrong with it? Uh, new air conditioner, new indicator. Okay, I might as well replace the tires because they'll be on their way out soon anyway. And then when we see what we can do with the assignments on that. Oh, it's coming in now. I might not even have time to, to paint the bus. Hmm. Oh, the service center's busy. 
<laughs> well, I'll, I'll do that next episode. <laughs> Just ignore the issue. I'll do it next episode, boys. I'll do it next episode. Uh, right. Do I have time to paint this, you reckon? We'll give it a go. More assignments are coming in. Alright, let's gonna paint that bus real quick right now. Load. Paint. Thank you very much. Uh, bus fleet. Buy a used bus. And... Oh, that needs a lot of repairing. Can I lowball this? Rejected. Uh, oh, I mean, that, is, that needs a new battery. Right, rejected. 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 Oh, man, it needs a new battery, boys. And they accepted it as well. God damn it. Right. I do have a new battery in stock. Oh, that's a lot of repairing. That's a lot of repairing I've got to do. But it might put me in the position that... <sighs> right, tomorrow, for a reset and then a sign everything... I'm still missing some buses still. Damn. <laughs> Don't look at the service center. Oh my goodness me. Don't look at the service center, boys. Look at that. Look at that right now. That is pain. That is actual pain right now. We don't talk about that. We don't talk about it. Oh dear God. Right. Oh, we got an unexpected delay with that as well. Use buses. It's all e-ways. Um, so what do we need then to be able to research a new bus? We'll take a look at this next episode. What do you reckon I should do, boys? Research the last double-decker? Or research an articulated bus? So many decisions. So many decisions. This has got to go out, by the way, but there's now a delay. So that's now got a delayed assignment. That's not good. How's my rating, anyway? My rating looks pretty high. Oh, it's dramatically raised recently. I've been asked the fact that we're doing more of the um, public service light, uh, routes. So there's just generally more space on the buses for the for them. I've got to clean a lot of my buses as well. I'm holding out for the automatic bus wash stuff. That delay right now is ridiculously long. It really is. Right, another offer accepted. I don't even know what's wrong with this bus. Uh, needs new tires. I need to start thinking about ordering some more replacement parts because I'm, I'm going through them. Right, all the buses are assigned for today. Let me reset that. Assign. Drivers. Apparently I don't have enough drivers either. Um. Right, multiple buses are being repaired. What? How, how many have I got of each bus right now? I've got eight double-deckers. And 18 minibuses. I didn't realize that these were classed as minibuses. I honestly didn't realize. Oh, it's still busy over there. Right, let's paint both of these buses. That needs recharging as well, by the way. Which it's doing it now. So how many buses have I got again? Sorry. I got 26 in total. Is that 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. I'm four parking spaces short. <laughs> I don't have enough parking spaces, boys. All right, let's get them set up real quick. So where is it? Street, uh, large parking space. So one, two, three. Oh no, it's 5. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I did have enough. 
I thought this was four in a row. I think I counted the solar panel things, didn't I? I think that's what I must have done, is counting the solar panels. All right, build this going around the edge now. And then we'll treat that there as the little walkway going out for our big new variation of our service center. It'll be for where the workers can walk out and then go to their little restaurant and stuff like that. Oh, we've got enough trophies, by the way, boys. 240 right now to get the automatic cleaning of the buses. So we'll research the faster charging. That'll be a big one for us. Reduce wear and tear is another big one. Uh, and we'll also get the better food for the employees and automatic washing of the buses. So this is the outside of the buses, by the way. This is the outside. So... As of tomorrow, then, if I reset it and assign, we're still we're still a little bit short on drivers as well. So bus fleet, buy buses, electro liners. Um, they accepted that. I'll try and buy a second one as well. They accepted both of them. I don't think I'm going to have enough parts now to fix these. So I'll fix what I can on them. We need some more tires. So let me order some replacement parts. I'll try and have nine of everything. Minus the batteries. Because they're too expensive. I'll, I'll order one. That's all I need, isn't it? Yeah, that's all I need. Um, right, deliver because I'm spending that much money. I might as well pay for immediate delivery. It makes no difference to me. It makes no difference. I'll paint the buses while we're waiting for them parts to be placed in our warehouse. There is now so many of them. There we go. Load local templates. E folio. So two brand new double deckers as well. That's huge. And now I've got ten of them. 28, so that's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I got 30 parts. I can buy two more. I've only got space basically to park two more buses in my depot. So that's pretty cool to see. I feel like I just made like loads of progress this episode. I don't know if you guys feel that, but I feel like I just made like a ton of progress this episode. All right, can I now repair what's needed to be repaired? The tires have not been placed in the warehouse yet. We're still waiting for those to be uh, placed in. More's coming in right now with the deliveries. And in terms of staff, we also need to hire more bus drivers. I just realized that. So, one, two. Oh, only two more. Then I need more lockers. Wow, we hired so many more with what we've got here. Uh, so, in the shift schedule, then, for tomorrow, I now have enough. Oh, let me reset it. I have enough drivers. Just need. An additional bus. Is it a potential that I can buy another one? <laughs> another Electroliner? That needs a new battery. Maybe I'll buy a City one. Rejected. Right, there we go. I haven't lowballed too much. New indicator. So these buses now smoking need new tyres. You need new tires. So those three buses should now be repaired. Do, 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 do. There we go. Do I only have two mechanics? No, I've got four. So that bus, where is it? Where's it gone? Oh, no, it's still here. I need to paint that bus as well. And then technically, in the shift schedule for tomorrow... I now have all buses and drivers assigned for all my current routes. Look at how filthy the buses are, though. Well, that bus is broken as well. Repair. Needs a new indicator. Any other buses smoking? You are. A new wiper. There we go. So I'm waiting for automatic bus washing to be researched because I want to see them do it all at once. Uh, in general, that's what I want to see, which is why it stopped me. For, why I'm stopping from cleaning them myself now, anyway. 
But I now have a total of 29 buses. 29 buses in my company. Holy moly, have times changed. They really have. So what we now need to do is because we're going to be making exuberant amount of money, there's no question about it, we're going to be making ridiculous amounts of cash at this point. Um, we look, look at that, nearly 200 grand yesterday. We may have a hundred grand in revenue, but pure profit, damn. Ridiculous, right? Ridiculous. We now need to take a look at researching bigger and better buses and replacing our current smaller buses with higher capacity buses so we can just in general carry more passengers. That's what we'll do next episode. So what should I research first? The new double decker or the, the last remaining double decker or should I go articulated? And also, we need to look at expanding our service center. We've got more room here to build a nice big rectangle for it. We'll do a nice little corridor that exits out so the workers can get to the bathroom and the kitchen. I could build one here. I could do. But they can walk. They've got legs. Use your legs. <laughs> anyway, boys, we'll end it for here. The company has now transformed dramatically which hopefully the money I've got right now I can invest back into the company to making it absolutely amazing. There's still so much stuff I've got to do, so much stuff I've got to buy, but it's very, very expensive. Until next time, I'll see you all soon. So good.